What is up, everybody? My name is Unseen Light, you call me UNSL, and welcome to Escaping the Prison. Now, last time I played the first one, which was Breaking the Bank, and this is the first in the series. Well, actually, the one I'm playing right now is the second, and there are like five in total. We've only gotten to like two. But, uh, if you don't know what this is, this is basically about a guy I named Henry Stickman, and as you see in the corner there, and he got into a lot of trouble back, back then. Like, he just broke a bank, Hank, for one. And now, he has to escape the prison. And then late later, he steals a diamond and uh, help, helps the military or join in some gang. And then he escapes a super prison or some, something. I don't know. Oh, but I do know that I've been explaining things a bit too much, so let's get started. Oh, you. Yeah? You're free to go. I'm free to go! <laughs> oh. Oh, thanks. Oh, okay. Woo! Oh, Alright. Ha 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 ha! My endless barrage of choices! Well, let's get things started then. Let's start with the drill. Drill your way out. Well, that was easy. Uh, let's see what the opacitator does. Alright. You'll walk through walls. Just move the blue slider to the right and you'll become as opaque, that means see-through for all you uneducated folks, as you want. Not only that, but the more opaque you get, the easier it will be for you to pass through solid objects. Is that so, Gadget Gate? Oh, it really works! <laughs> uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. We went and straight to the Earth's core. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. You think something like that would come up in beta tech? It's team. Well, no wonder. No wonder I didn't. <laughs> All right. Crowbar. Easiest tool ever. Oh, uh... Yeah. Ah, run! What? Oops. Don't worry, I heard prison dentists are great. <laughs> oh, nice. Yo! Oh, jeez. Oh! What? Brawl reference? What? I don't necessarily get the joke, but... Ah, oh, whatever. Oh, great. This music is really bumping. Well, that was something out of the Matrix. Oh, what's this? <laughs> okay, that's out of the matrix. I can't do it. <laughs> Yeah, hands up, boy. Wow, I got out that easily? The badass ending. <laughs> nice. Alright, what do we have next? Uh, cell phone. Turn these, huh? Oh. Hi. 
Brook Chicken? What? You don't get the ref reference. Uh, this is Ace Attorney. <laughs> it was a game about uh, lawyers, and you played as a game named called Phoenix Rights. A law lawyer with spiky hair. People are always talking about that. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Here we go. Now we have to choose a piece of as uh, of evidence. Sorry. My speech impediment is, uh, really nerve-wracking at this point. Uh, mysterious device. Present that. Take that. Ah! What is this? It's evidence. And how exactly do we do the new thing? Oh, I was just kidding. Imagine. This is no time for jokes. I see no reason to put for long this crap. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman, Guilty. Hang on a sec. Yeah, my door is wide open. I'll be right back. I'm back. All right. Let's do this right this time. Disguising bag. The bag the defendant hit in, in, in order to sneak into the bank. The knot is tied on the outside of the bag. <gasps> How is that? How is that possible? Take that! Is, is that the bag the defendant hit in? Yes, but there's one thing that's been bothering me. The defendant really was hiding in this bag. How did he tie the knot from the outside of the bag? Ah! He was inside the bag. It'd be impossible for him to tie that knot on the outside. Oh. But then, how did he do it? It's simple. He didn't. Oh. What are you saying? I'm saying my client wasn't hiding in that bag at all. He was stuffed in there. By this very witness! Oh. As you can see by this doctor's analysis, the defendant had taken quite the beating. I was in the bag. He was unconscious. <laughs> this is absurd. The witness was attempting to dispose of the body. He left the defendant in the bag, knowing he'd drive by it on the way back to the bank. When the witness and his partner passed the bag, he convinced his partner to throw the bag in with the other. But, but why would he do that? Why, to dispose of the body, of course. There are millions of bags of money in that bank, and the witness knew it would take a long time before the victim was found. But unfortunately for the witness, his victim woke up and tried to escape from the tomb. He was arrested on the spot, and the witness thought everything was over. But it's come back to haunt him now. You guys can't, you can't, you can't. <laughs> no! <laughs> well, that certainly was an interesting trial. However, I'm now ready to deliver my verdict. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman, not guilty. <laughs> so I'm free. I'm free to steal diamonds. Lamenting. <laughs> That may have been late aim for some people, but I thought that was pretty cool. I mean, I never played much Ace Attorney in my youth, but as far as I know, it's pretty good. I and mean, also had a pretty cool anime. If you don't know how old that there is an Ace Attorney anime, you should go look up that up. All right, rocket launcher. That always works, right? Convenience! Oh! Way to aim. Well, you didn't even give me an option. 
Didn't give me a way to aim. Alright. Teleporter! This always works. Uh oh. What? What? I teleported to a shooting range, really? Come on. <laughs> Just can't seem to get the hang of that thing, can't. And you. <laughs> if I had a teleporter, I'd get the hang of it. Maybe. <laughs> Alright, anyway. Energy drink. Oh, that wasn't energy, that was just liquid crack. I got about 30 seconds before my brain explodes or whatever. What? How did... You know what? I'm not even gonna question it. Was that really necessary? Probably. I mean, sure, the guy was a jerk, but... It wasn't that bad. Oh. Uh, energy. Side effects include nausea, headaches, rapid heart heartbeat, and possibilities of stroke and or heart attack. Hmm, well that's good to know. Yes, it is. It would have been great to know oh, before I drank it. Without question. Alright. Let's go with the classic route. The file. Uh, the window. Yeah, that'll work. That, yeah. Pro tip. Look before you leave. I just want, want to see every failure there is. Because, hey, I'm a sucker for, for the extra content. Cell door. Oh, oops. Yeah, I'll deal with that later. Hey! What's that? Eyes fidgeting. Hey, he's yeah, I am. I'm getting out of here closer than. Wait, is that a belt of grenades? That's a belt of grenades. Who leaves a? Who leaves a belt of grenades lying here? All right, we got. We gotta use the belt of grenades. We gotta. Chase yourself for you. What are the chances? What are the chances? I don't even know what to say about that one. You don't, huh? Alright. Chair. Left. Uh oh, no, fatty. How do you know if I'm fat or not? I'm not fat. I checked. Oh, whatever. Okay, okay, I'll go right. It's because, as I always say, right is right and left is not right. And let's go with the go with the jetpack. Oh! <laughs> oh no! Oh! All right, I'm right, fine. Parachute. Oh. Uh. Alright, fine, whatever. Alright. Rope. That ought to work. This 
seems awfully. Yeah, I know. Oh, and by the way, if I uh, if I posted this with my my uh, breaking in the bank in playthrough, I apologize. I'll try not to do as much much um, reposting in the future. All right, last one. Plungers. <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I couldn't help myself. <laughs> so, that was Escaping the Prison. Hope you guys enjoy what you did. If you did, did be sure to leave a like, like down below. Oh, what? Com comment for more. Or, and most importantly, if you have a suggestion as to what I should play a next, or if you have a video suggestion in that you want me to react to, let me know down right in the comments. But until till then, I'm the Unseen Light, and as always, keep your lights.